broadcast by the Department of Defense of the Republic. A paranormal anomaly affecting the entire nation has been detected. For your safety, please carry out the following instructions. Attention, have you seen this tree? Hopefully you have not, as this is a lipidendron, and it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this tree, you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. A lipidendron tree, also known as the scale tree, is an extinct prehistoric tree, which was one of the most abundant trees of the Carboniferous period. It lived in some of the wettest parts of the prehistoric coal swamps and commonly grew in dense stands. Earth's new climate regime appeared to be too much for the scale trees to handle, and they were driven to extinction. But due to the time rip, these trees came back. Seeing this tree is one of the most common ways you can tell you are in a time rip. So check outside and look for this tree. Attention! Have you seen this bird? Hopefully you have not, as this is a passenger pigeon, and it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this bird, you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. The passenger pigeon, or wild pigeon, is an extinct species of pigeon that was endemic to North America. The extinction of the passenger pigeon had two major causes. Commercial exploitation of pigeon meat and a massive scale and loss of habitat. It went extinct by 1914. Attention! Have you seen this plant? Hopefully you have not, as this is a Cooksonia, and it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this plant, you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. A Cooksonia is an extinct type of simple plant similar to a moss that lived in the late Silurian to early Devonian. For 15 million years ago, it was the first land plant that had true veins. The Cooksonia plant is only a few millimeters in height. Look out for it, as this could determine if you are in a rip. Attention! Have you seen this bird? Hopefully you have not, as this is a Carolina parakeet. And it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this bird, you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. The Carolina parakeet was a brilliantly colored, medium-sized parrot that traveled in large, noisy flocks of around 300. It typically lived in old, swampy forests and was once widespread across eastern North America, from the Gulf of Mexico all the way to southern Ontario. 
The Carolina Parakeet went extinct in 1939. Attention! Have you seen this sea creature? Hopefully you have not, as this is a Anomalocaris, and it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this animal you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. Anomalocaris was an ancient marine creature that lived over 500 million years ago. It was a large predator with a long segmented body and had appendages used for capturing Hello, no one is available to take your call. Please leave a message after the tone. Listen man, I don't think it's right to leave people in the dark about this situation. This was our fault. We are responsible and we have to tell the public so they can actually be safe and warn them about the events. People have the right to know if they are actually a victim of this. And we don't even know if this could be deadly yet. We have no idea what can come out of those time rips. I'm sorry, but I'm going to the Ministry of Defense to publish a statement warning all citizens about this. Let's hope those bastards don't cut the important parts out. Because there can be some seriously dangerous animals that come out of that. I'm sorry, but this has to be done. Goodbye. Attention! Have you seen this bird? Hopefully you have not, as this is a dodo bird. And it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this bird, you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. The dodo bird is an extinct flightless bird that was endemic to the island of Mauritius, which is east of Madagascar, in the Indian Ocean. The dodo bird went extinct around 1690. Due to deforestation, hunting, and destruction of their nests by animals brought to the island by the Dutch. Attention! Have you seen this sea creature? Hopefully you have not, as this is an Ichthyosaurus, and it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this animal you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. Ichthyosaurs were giant marine reptiles that resemble fish and dolphins. They are usually over 25 meters long. Ichthyosaur species varied from 1 to 20 meters in length. Ichthyosaurs are very similar to dolphins. So pay close attention when you see one. Attention! Have you seen this bird? Hopefully you have not, as this is a moa, and it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this bird, you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. Moa are an extinct group of flightless birds. They are related to ostriches, emu, and cassowaries. This giant birds look much like ostriches and emu do today. But they would have towered over them, reaching about 12 feet tall, which is nearly double the height of modern ostriches. Attention! Have you seen this bird? Hopefully you have not, as this is a great arc. And it is extinct. If you are in fact seeing this bird, you have fallen into some sort of rip in the fabric of time. Remain calm. Great arcs were large flightless seabirds. This animal looks similar to a penguin, but great ox are only distantly related to penguins. Look out for this creature as this could determine if you were in a time rift. If you have seen any of these anomalies, you are unfortunately a victim of a time rift. But remain calm. These creatures are not deadly and you will be very safe. You will not die brutally. 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 <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.